Hey, this is Adam with the Cubify team, here to give you a couple of tips about your cube. After you've plugged in your cube, press the touchscreen. It'll help you along the way. Start by going to Setup, then Load Cartridge. Unwrap the cartridge and remove the screw on the side. Press Next, and the print tip will begin to heat up, pushing out any material already in the printer. Hit Next again. If you've used your cartridge before, cut the end of the material so that it's clean when it goes in. Now push the material through the clear tube letting a little stick out the end, and press next again. Feed the end into the print jet, and hit next one more time. Push a little bit, and the material will begin coming out on the tip. Be careful, the tip gets really hot. Now that the material is ready, set the gap between the print jet and the print pad. Go to Setup, press next, then hit Set Gap. Put a regular piece of paper, folded in half, on the print pad and use the up and down arrows to let the paper just begin to move freely like this. Press the check mark to save the setting. Just before you print, take off the print pad and apply the cube glue so that your piece will stay put. Go in circles for a thin, even coat covering all areas you'll be printing on. Put the pad back on the cube and you're ready to print. Sync via Wi-Fi or insert a USB stick with the .cube file you want to print. Hit print and scroll to choose the file that you want. Once you select it, the printer will heat up and start printing your piece within five minutes. The print tip and the print pad heat up during the printing process. It's like that so that it prints correctly, so be careful. This icon on the screen shows you when your cube is hot, so you know when to touch it safely. Once the print's finished and the pad's cooled off, take it off the cube and dunk it in some water to dissolve the glue. Your piece will pop right off. For any other helpful tips, go ahead by going over to cubify.com and we'll be able to help you out with anything you need there. Using the cube is just that simple, and we can't wait to see what you'll make.